David, we told you about those groups of drones spotted flying in western Nebraska last week. Well, the sightings have moved into Sarpy, Saunders, Cass and Douglas counties, even Mills County, Iowa. Tonight, we're talking to Offutt Air Force Base about the big challenges presented by these small aircraft. Atop the air traffic control tower, a team of people spends each day watching the skies around Offutt Air Force Base. We monitor all aircraft in and out of our terminal area. Senior Master Sergeant Jason Rusi says the rise in use of drones or unmanned aircraft systems presents a unique challenge. Unfortunately, a lot of these uh, smaller UASs, uh, they're not large enough to show on radar and uh, based on the fact that we're in a control tower, our we're limited to our visual range. A recent spike in reported drone sightings around the region has people asking questions. The Cass County Sheriff's Department took multiple calls about groups of drones Tuesday night. One woman reported seeing 12 fly overhead. Officials in Saunders and Sarpy County got reports, as did the Sheriff's Department in Mills County, Iowa. In Douglas County, Sheriff's Deputy Gerald Madsen responded to a call of two drones spotted near 204th and Maple. Was just concerned that it might be something that wasn't supposed to be going on. Madsen says when he got to the area, he saw it for himself. About a mile to the east, I saw a drone flying. Uh, it was it was lit. Back in Offutt, anyone looking to fly in the base's airspace must apply for a certificate of authorization. And the Federal Aviation Administration has strict rules when it comes to drone use of any kind. Rusi says they haven't run into any issues with unauthorized drones yet, but... It certainly is something that uh, would be concerning for us because uh, our primary concern is to maintain flight safety. And none of the law enforcement agencies we spoke with had any idea where these drones might be coming from. If you see suspicious drone activity, you should report it to the FAA. We reached out to the Federal Aviation Administration to see if there are any updates and did not get a response tonight. The Nebraska State Patrol is planning to start a task force to handle these sightings. Reporting live tonight, Alexandra Stone, KETV Newswatch 7.